Okay, welcome back to more Pokemon Soul Silver. I'm not wasting any time because I have to take on the whole gym in this one, and I don't want to lose. Yeah. I'm on like I've been recording a lot of these. It's like it's like the third one in a row that I've that I've uh, recorded. I'm just gonna like do this cuz and then I'm gonna stop recording for a while bug catcher the bug type gym yeah unfortunately you don't see any like of the good bug types in here you only see like caterpie and stuff the only good bug type you see is the gym leaders, which stinks. You know what I think's weird? How he has a Scyther instead of like a Heracross. And I, th I thought, I think it actually, it'd also be cool if it had, he had like a Pinecrow on his team. But he doesn't. That doesn't spoil him. Like, cause, okay. Scyther's from Kanto, and this is Johto, and Heracross is from Johto, so shouldn't he have Heracross? I don't know. I don't know. But I think if it had Heracross, that would be too hard. Plus, I don't think Heracross can learn a U-turn, which, uh, which he gives out. This guy is, like, so weird looking. He's like a she-man. And in the anime, he sounds like he's, like, in freaking preschool. Like, what is this? I don't know. Stinking Weedle. Shooting me with string and... Stinging me with needles. I don't, I don't like this. Got a bad feeling about this place. Oh, and the string. I must be, like, completely covered in string right now. Like, like, in, like, a cocoon or something. Like, and I'm still able to move. I'm, I don't know. Ugh. Like, this gym and, like, bug types, like, this gym in no way shows how good bugs type bug types can be like only good pokemon that's in here is scyther there's just one it's like it's just a gym full of terrible pokemon if it had like actually good pokemon like maybe pincer and heracross maybe like pineco or something which one of all the fortress it's pretty good like, why don't they have, like, those guys? And, uh, well, and, like, if, if you're gonna have, like, Weedle and stuff, at least have him evolve. This guy, I think, is, like, he has a Beedrill, and he's, like, the only guy who has one. Which, ooh, a critical hit. That I, uh, that is good. I, uh, I would have been annoyed if I didn't get that end. Harden. Gross. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Likes my hoppers. And ooh, level 18. Beedrill. Yeah. Like, Beedrill is, isn't even, like, that good. Like, <laughs> like Butterfree in a and black and white. It's it's pretty good with like quiver dance and stuff, but Beedrill doesn't get like anything. He's just <sighs> He's just Beedrill. And Beedrill he will stay forever. And ooh, yeah. He gives out a lot of experience though. So that's that's a plus. But um 
<sighs> and ooh, evolving. <sighs> it's so beautiful. It's... Don't press B. Skip loom. All right. Check it out. Stats don't get that much. I mean, stats are better than hoppets, but. It's alright. It's alright. You know, I think. I'm just gonna go through with Crocona for the rest, cause uh, I'm gonna need Crocona to be as strong as possible for uh, for the gym fight. Because like, even though like Scyther, like Scyther is the only good Pokemon in the gym, but. Uh, like, it is, like, really good for, like, it's hard. It is difficult to beat if you picked a Chikorita, like, or something. If you picked, and it's, it's kind of hard if you got a Totodile, but if you picked a, uh, Cyndaquil, it's... It's pretty much like a breeze, just beating that thing. Can do some good damage to you, but, uh, not too bad. We got a double battle up in here. Oh, that sounded so lame. <laughs> yeah, this is actually the last battle of the gym. And, oh, I, I hate Spinarak sound. It's it's like screech and loud. It's like, God. Yeah, I'm just gonna uh, aim for Lettyba, cause uh, well, that did more than I expected. I mean, I know Lettyba, Let Lettyba is like really bad defense, but not bad, Skipluma. I must say, I'm impressed. And that did like one HP. Mm. But yeah, so, yeah, oh and sweet, I know how to use a, I was gonna like use a potion on him after the battle to heal him up all the way, cause this is the last battle of the gym other than the actual gym battle, and, oh come on, <sighs> but I forgot he had the shell bell, so, now I'm not gonna be have to waste a potion on like, cause for a gym fight, really every uh everything counts, every uh every little HP. And like, if you have like a Cyndaquil or something, like it's you'll breeze through most of the gyms in this game if you picked a Cyndaquil. I'm just saying. It is, like, really good against the gym. Like, almost all the gyms. Especially, uh... Second... Uh... The fifth, sixth... So... Yeah. Yeah. Save the game. Alright, so this is Bugsy. And. Like, how is. How is that a boy? I don't. I don't understand. I don't see how that could be a boy. And he starts off with a Scyther. Level 17, Technician, with Quick Attack, U Turn, Leer, and Focus Energy. This thing just, just, is 
freaking horrible. <sighs> Same type of attack bonus U turn does loads of damage. Yeah. I actually, I actually expected that to do a lot more. I thought it might even KO, but. I don't know. Yeah, plus with that technician, it's quick attack, supposed to uh, boost it up by 50%. So, um, it effectively makes it have same type of attack bonus. So, focus energy is annoying because it raises its critical hit, so is Leer, because it lowers your defense. You know, the whole deal. But, uh, but yeah, the Metapod, level 15, only knows tackle. That's it. Don't even need to. It is easy. It is so so easy. And he's going for focus energy. That that doesn't really scare me. Luckily, he doesn't have anything to heal up this scyther. So really, I could just paralyze it. I mean, like heal up its uh, status ailments. So really, I should switch into Totodile. I just don't wanna risk it dying. Yeah, it also has that, uh, that citrus berry, which will restore its HP in a pinch, which is annoying. I'll also say he has a Kakuna, which is level 15, and only knows the move Poison Sting. Yeah, so they're just terrible. And why did he use Quick Attack? Ooh, that did, like, exactly half. So unless, unless... He, uh, yeah, I guess that hit for, like, maximum damage. That hit for, like, a little bit less. I don't know if I should heal or what. Um, you know what? I'm just, let's see. I'm just gonna use a super potion on, uh, on Totodot. I mean, Krokona. Krokona. He's evolved now. Ooh, and now I can use a, use a super potion on Skiploom. So, Yeah. If you pick Chikorita, this fight is just horrible. If you pick Chikorita, I, you should get like an Onyx or a Geodude, level it up to like about 15, and uh, rock, and like uh, teach it like rock throw, or you could just teach a rock tomb through that TM, like just get like a Pokemon that could get like rock tomb, teach it to it through the TM, and this could do skip them in. And I lived. And yeah, I'll just put this thing to sleep. Even though I don't think it can do anything to me. I just don't want it to kill him with poison sting. <laughs> kill him with fire. <laughs> so, I'm gonna kill him. Tackle. I'm not going to make a bait. I'm going to make him die. Because I'm evil. Oh, yeah. Shed skin for the ability. I forgot about that. So, like, I lived, and, yeah, so much for that, that's okay, you fought like a, like a real pro, Skiploom, you did good, you did good, so, yeah, Up to level 20. So, yeah, let's just sight there. Yeah, I'm not your bug Pokemon, you little stinker. And that is the battle. I beat him. That, it, that went better than I expected it to. I, uh... I'm happy, though. Also, I forgot what uh, Geodude learns, like, self-destruct at. It might be, like, level 20 or something. But, uh... If you have a Geodude, you could always just kind of send in for, like, a suicide. Just, just for an easy kill if you don't want to, like, risk anything. You could just... Go boom on it. I don't know. Just 
it doesn't matter because I got the badge and I got U-turn. And uh, Skip Loom can actually learn U-turn. Or maybe that's only Jump Pluff when it evolves, but it actually learns it through level up. Which is, uh, I don't think too many Pokemon actually learn U-turn. Which is kind of cool because, uh, because, yeah. And that egg says it'll hatch soon. So, uh, you know, maybe it'll hatch in, like, the next one, but... Yeah, I'm just gonna heal my guys. You know what? I beat the gym leader, and I'm gonna end this off here. So, uh, next time on Pokemon Soul Silver, I'm gonna head into the, uh, the place to the left. I forgot what it's called, but, uh, see you then.